Hi guys, I have been experimenting a little with sound and I've uh, tested what happens in uh, NGX when you put on different things. So here we have the cold and dark, dark stage of the NGX and I will put, down, put on some power. And now we have uh, the battery switch on, you can hear that it is no particular sound at the moment. Uh, at all. If I uh, set uh, ground connection to let's say ground power on you can hear uh, you can hear that there's a buzzing sound or some fans or something like that and if I turn off the ground power it peeps uh, it's, it's the, the peep that you heard there was the sound that uh, tells the, the ground personnel that the, the, the ground power is turned off and they can remove the uh, ground power uh, if uh, we look at those sounds uh, I have uh, copied them to the ProSim folder and you can see here, let's see um, audio files and GX, various we have, first of all, we have the cockpit sound where do we have it? Uh, gear, gear, up, ground, call, ground, call we have the ground call, uh, you can hear that first it's, it's loud so so it it just blinked there. You you can we can try it again. So if I put on the ground power, you can see there, and put it off. Uh, one more time. The sound goes away. Uh, anyway, uh, I remove that ground power and I start the AQ no sound at all just the the sound of the the button let's find that uh, sound uh, first uh, cockpit there we have it so here we have the cockpit sound uh, I've taken these uh, sounds and I used the uh, audio uh, audacity audacity I don't know how you pronounce that actually uh, but uh, out of city and use this program and copy that uh, that sound uh, and just lower the I can show you how I lower the the cockpit sound so here we have the sound and I just drag this to lower it to uh, 3 dB or 5 dB or what you think what you think is close to to NGX sound and then to to make the fade in sound you have to listen how how long does it take for the sound to fade in so let's 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 put on ground power again and put on it it like it takes about one two seconds one two three yeah yeah so about about three seconds two two three seconds it takes for it to go to full power so then I, I just uh, click here and uh, take this two, two and a half seconds and uh, s tone it in, I don't know, fade in the sound and you can see that it fade in so listen, let's listen to it yeah so it's, it's the same, it fades in and then I use export marking so export marking and save it as the fade in sound and do the exactly the same thing with with the with the sound <laughs> with the other sound so that is how you c can create sounds for ProSim and NGX and uh, if we take uh, let's say take another sound uh, we have the uh, pack sound it sounds really loud. Let's see where we have it. Uh, 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 the packs. Where do we have the packs? 
Yeah, the pack sound sounds like this. We have the exit sound. It sounds like this on the outside of the aircraft when the packs are on, uh, running, and we, it sounds like this inside. But it doesn't actually sound like this uh, in Prosim, in uh, NGX. Uh, so we have to lower that. And let's listen to that sound that I have uh, modified. Uh, I have actually three sounds, pack on and fade in and fade uh, off. And I, I have um, the pack sound is for the, the fans too, uh, the, the, the circulation fans. And so I, I have a fade in left sound and fade in right, right sound. Uh, let's, let's look at this. Uh, pack sounds low. So here you can see the sound, it's, it's much less noise, much less noise. And let's look in the NGX how the pack sound sounds. So we have the, the APU is running and uh, then we can put the APU on and we can hear the cockpit sound and let's put on the packs. Uh, on high. Can you hear it? And we, you can hear the fade off sound. And if you put, put the right fan on, you can also sort of hear the sound. So there we have it. And what more can you hear? You can hear the hydraulic pumps. One, two, three. So about three seconds for it to fade in. I turn off it. I, so when I turn this on, I can't hear any hydraulic uh, sound because I have no engine running. But one, one more time. And you can hear the sound from the fuel pumps. I, I'm, I'm hoping Mark will add a gate for the fuel pump so I can add that sound too. It's really hard to hear that sound. really hard but I, I have the sound here so uh, we can turn this this off uh, at the moment so turn that off and maybe you wonder what how, where the the avionics uh, that sounds the, the the sound I I thought that that sound was the high uh, the 400 hertz sound, but it actually the standby instruments and, and and I guess I'm just guessing, but I think it is the gyros in the uh, horizon. But listen to this. Uh, no, not wheel hooks. Uh, let's see. It's uh, ground connection. Ah, it's equipment. The payload, ground connection, doors, pushback. I uh, now menu, PND set cup, aircraft equipment, uh, Honeywell Collins. Uh, no, uh, there, there we have it. Standby instrument. If I put this to analog instruments, you can hear the sound. If, and uh, if I put off the battery switch, it turns off. So there we have it. So I, I guess that. It is this in instrument that uh, is sounding like this. And let's go back, set up. I have to. I will show you how it sounds in uh, Prosim in my next, next clip.